Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm very excited to use a pre-trained model to categorize the cats and dogs binary classification which we have been doing for the past few videos. So pretty much the loading of the data set is the same as my previous videos except for certain steps. So we now have to import TensorFlow underscore hub as hub. So this is where we'll be using the model mobile net. You can install it using this command pip install upgrade space tensorflow space hub okay so mobile net they are trained on different height and width it will be 224 by 224 so take note so those are the only differences so now we are going to use mobile net version 2 from this website if you go to tensorflow hub you can find various models where you can use them so now we are going to use classify model as mobile net underscore v2. So this training, loading of the training set and the evaluation set is the same. The only difference is that I'm going to use one instead of 10 since mobile net is, from what I've seen, it does not support batch training. So the first input layer, we are going to use hub.keras layer. And then this is where we are going to have our pre-trained pre model, mobile net, input shape, is going to be 224 by 224 with three channels. Trainable, we are going to use force. Since we are not going to train the model, we are going to keep it as force. This is called transfer learning. We are not going to train any weights from this pre-trained model. And we are going to name it pre-trained mobile net embedding. So if you don't know about mobile net, it has been trained on image net data set where there are millions, where it has been trained on millions of labeled images so we can use for our general use so this is pretty much the same we are going to have we, we can have one embedding layer meaning you can ask me why do i have why am i using a pre-trained model with a training data set so the training data set is to train this embedding layer to use for our specific use so in this case i'm just going to categorize chess and dogs so this training data set will be trained on this layer. And the output layer with one output and the activation is going to be sigma. So we are going to use binary accuracy. And then we are going to instantiate sequential model with the models we just built. Add an optimizer. Loss is binary cross entropy. Logic equals to false. And metrics equals to binary accuracy. And then we can fit the model. But before that, let me okay. Let me return the history as well. So that we can plot the training and the validation accuracy as well as the loss. So let's train the model. I'm going to have one embedding layer with uh, 16 neurons. So here we can see that we have about 3.5 million parameters from the mobile net model. However, the Trainable parameters are only 16,000 since we indicated that trainable is false. So now let's wait. Okay, the training is done. So we can see that the validation accuracy is about 0 0.98 and the Training accuracy is on the way at one. Thank you so much. Hopefully this is helpful. Bye-bye. Please subscribe.